Hi, Mike Santa here. I'm going to show you today how to uh, properly prep your gas pipe system. So from the get-go, I am approximately 19 inches apart right here from inside to inside. Uh, I'm assuming you're going to have your gas pipe set up already so that you have the proper distance. In order to get the right alignment, it's as simple as taking a straight piece of board and just clamping it onto your legs. Then you'll know the legs are completely parallel with each other. Of course, make sure you use a nice uh, straight piece of board and probably better to do it before you paint it. Um, so I have it set up just like that. And I just marked a little hole uh, here where I want to, or marked where I want the hole to be. So now I'm just gonna drill it through. This is a 5 16 bit. But you can see how the hole is going to go right through and the, the legs should be aligned. So now this should just fit through nicely and it's nice and tight. So now we're going to drill this other hole. So the second hole is drilled and that should fit pretty tightly in there. Uh, on a side note, as the pipe goes into the flange here, the pipe is actually on the other side, the opposite side of this flange. It's welded onto this pipe. So that's what makes this joint really strong. This does have to be welded from the inside. Next, we want to take this apart, and you got to probably break the bond that's in there. There's probably a little piece of pipe. Uh, the, from where you drilled, it might stick. So swing it a little so that they'll pull out. So on the next thing you want to do is on the outer pipe, on the bottom holes, you want to widen out this hole and this hole. You're only going to do these two holes. Don't go all the way through the top holes. The only two holes that need to be half an inch, widen out to half an inch is this one and this one. For your next step, you want to take one of your long bolts and you kind of you want to grind it down, grind one end down. The one end has to probably fit just a little bit into a half inch hole. So for your final assembly, you'll just take your tapered nut and put it together, of course, inside of your droid. Just like that. And you want to crank this down really tight uh, when it's in your droid. And uh, then the legs will not move at all. And you'll have the parallel droid. So now I will taper this and I'll put it in, into the droid body. <laughs> And now the legs are completely tied together and they don't shift or move. So that's it. If you have that problem right now, you can also retrofit your droid. 
just pull out the pipes, draw, drill your half inch hole, and uh, put in your bolts. And uh, that is the proper way to use and to configure your pipe system.